it's Whimsy and we're back today with a new episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We are going to continue in chapter 10, the Watcher of the Veil with Nanaki, or Red 13 if you prefer. I think we are going to do trials and Cloud is going to help him. That's what I'm thinking. But uh, yeah, let's shop it with, let's go. Now, off camera, I wanted to do um, like the Queen's Blood and other stuff like that, but actually we can't. We can't go, we're stuck. We have fast travel unavailable and when you get around here, the game is like, no, you gotta do the trials first. So, all right, I was not able to do that, but it's fine. I did the head case combat simulator thing with Chadley. Um, it's like the Mind Flayer with two Vargopolis, whatever they're called, that do self emulation and you're supposed to take out the Mind Flayer first before the other two dies. And I've talked about this before, I, um, I was doing that off camera and um, I was trying to make them sleep, I was trying to stop them, I was waiting for my stop materia basically to be, uh, my, my time materia to have stop on it so I could use it with magnify. Um, I think I gave it back here, yeah, now we have it. And I tried that, but stop really does not last a long time at all. Sleep is act was actually better in my attempts. It's just that sleep, it's a little bit bad because when you attack them, they get out of sleep. So I couldn't always control all three of them and make sure that they wouldn't attack. I even tried with combat savior, you know, the synergy skill with Aerit with um cloud and barrett she can do like help me like this right and then they are supposed to attack the same enemy as she is attacking but since i was putting sleep on all of them then they were like oh then we're good we can attack the others and then as soon as they do their three to one um the the Varga police uh, thing enemy as as soon as they do that after that they just keep spamming deafening scream and then that paralyzes you if you're not blocking and then they do self emulation basically they bound their their selves themselves on you and then kill themselves like self destruct basically and I was such a nightmare and I was like what can I freaking do maybe if i don't get paralyzed so i tried safety bit one of the equipment i thought maybe that would work it was like uh immune to poison and this and that and other things like that and i was like okay maybe i can try that so i put safety bit on like and and also synergy abilities were what pressurized the um, mind flayer so yuffie and cloud are in all my team are the two that I get synergy unlocked the earliest, basically, because I keep spamming stuff with Yuffie. Yuffie having her ATB, it's so fast, and I would put haste as well on them, and then they would just gain synergy really fast, and then I was able to pressurize the Mind Flayer, but then the other would die from, like, one of the enemies, and I just couldn't get it right. I was like, what What can I do that will stop others from attacking and killing the, uh, the, the enemies, right? Like, I just need one person, basically. I would be fine with one person, <laughs> like, laying it on the Mind Flayer <clears throat> as, as, as long as the others don't attack and, and don't get bounded, right? Like, bound. So I was like, okay, what do I have that I could that could work? So I tried the Ring of Enfeeblement, which puts you in a frog state, right? And I was like, maybe if I put two of them in a frog state and then one other that just lays it on the Mind Flayer. I don't think they can bound themselves on a frog. Like, maybe they can, you know, we never know. But I wanted to try. 
it was so easy it's definitely the way you're supposed to do it like i'm telling you guys if you've been struggling spoiler alert do that okay put ring of enfeeblement on two of your teammates i personally use tifa as my attacker my leader to kill the mind flayer but Honestly, you could do it with anyone. I am not kidding. Basically, what happens is that the two other enemies become, like, vacant. They, they just... I Like, idling. <coughs> I'm sorry. They're, like, idling. They, they don't do anything. They, they barely attack. They don't do deafening scream. And they don't try to self-immolate or bound themselves to your teammates so you're you're just you have all the time in the world to get rid of the mind flayer i did it first try with that strat so easy i swear guys i spent like i think i spent like at least an hour at least it's probably more than that maybe two hours of trying other things and nothing was working and i was kind of like this is really a head case for real, like it's not it's not for no reason. It's called like that, like I am busting my ass off here. What is not working out, you know? And I wish I had thought of the Ring of Enfeeblement before, but it's perfect strat. So if you guys were stuck on that too, then you know what to do. Like for real, Ring of Enfeeblement saved me. So yeah, I did that off camera, but that's it. Apart from that, I couldn't do anything, so okay. Let's play. I'm sorry, I talked about that a lot, but it's just I was going crazy Shall with we that. Begin? Yes. We can and do anything we else. Go. We shall begin. <laughs> I'm not angry. It's okay. <laughs> it's just I wanted to do some Queen's Blood. <laughs> I was really looking forward to it. What well, lies beyond? Now we follow the cave where it leads. Deep as it will take us. Huh? Uh? <laughs> what, what was that? It makes it sound like it's a machine, but it's like an orb. It's... I'm so curious how this works. <laughs> like, how? <laughs> I don't know, like... <laughs> what, what type of uh, science is this? <laughs> I guess it's a bit like magic. Maybe there's materia in it. I mean, uh, Mako. Has Nanaki told you anything about his parents? He doesn't yet? like his father. No. Nope. They were watchers, both of them. But they couldn't have been any more different. When our village came under attack, my mother fought with courage, with honor. She faced the enemy and laid down her life to save wow. us. My father, though, he turned tail and ran. He oh. was a coward. So then, you still haven't forgiven him. Why would I? Oh, oh. I see. Maybe that's the trial. He needs to forgive his father or something. I wonder if it's the same voice actor. For... For Red, for Nanaki. Like the red voice and the nanaki voice is it the same voice actor because that's incredible work <laughs> from this point onward only two may proceed he who shall undertake the trial and his observer okay who's gonna observe i'll do it oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh that would render the trial meaningless but didn't he say that i was going but if not him. Ah, you do nicely. Me? Uh, him? Really? At least pretend not to hate me. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Ready. <gasps> wow. Okay. Uh I don't know if uh, if we can um not really. Buy this, no problem. Now, let me see about maybe a cess that I would need. I don't need synergy unless I put it with Barret. I was thinking maybe elemental instead. 
elemental just just putting everything uh Wow, we have Blazaga and everything. Holy! That's crazy! I didn't know we were that... Uh... I'll put this, maybe? I think it would be better if I really switch everything. So, like this. Elemental Fire and Ice, Lightning and Wind. We don't need these. Spirit up, MP up, HP up. I'm gonna put another MP up, I think. Uh, we don't need synergy support right now. We would need... Uh, I could do synergy something, like synergy wind or... I think it could be cool. And we need a uh, assess. We need DSS here. Uh, precision defense we already got as earrings. Maybe first strike. First strike could be good. Oops, sorry about that. I didn't mean to do that. Like that. And uh, yeah, let's put disempowerment, revival. I'll take off disempowerment. We'll put you here. Uh, we have chakra. Oh, we don't have a heal. So we will put that on you, I think. Because we don't have it right now. A heal could be good. And uh, synergy, yeah, like a synergy uh, fire. Why not? Something like that, you know? Oh, I think we we have pretty much everything like this. Okay, we're ready. Make sure that you are well prepared. Make sure that I mean, you I are don't well know what, prepared. What to Blessings expect. of the planet upon you. These caves can be perilous, even for seasoned watchers. Be careful. Can I talk to them? No. Okay. I guess. I guess we're going. You gonna watch my back? Yep. Burning holes in you right now. <laughs> what is this? This is a place of deep sorrow. A place where those who have been sealed away are no, left he to sits down. their fates. Okay. Okay, okay let's me. go! You just float yourself oh, up fuck. into another. Yeah, I haven't put uh as a oh, oh, oh. shortcut. So these are new. Nidhogg. Oh, Nidhogg. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Fire. If no problem. I weren't going to already. It's over. <laughs> Ooh. Uh. You got this. All right. Watch and learn. This is due. Got a hold up. It's not over yet. Yeah. <laughs> Please. End of the line. Yeah, I think we did all right back there. Oh, that is so cute. His grunts are lucky. still the same. Look here. <sighs> Such walls should be well within your power to climb. Oh, hey, we approach going surfaces and use that to scamper along walls. Stop moving or press. Uh, circle to draw. Remember to watch where you land. Okay, let me just put a um, a shortcut right here. Of assess. Yes. Thank you. Because I use that all the time. Okay, so there, there, and then here can we go? Yeah, we can. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> we the damn minion. Oh, that's fun. Whoa, that was kind of weird. Nice. Ah, it's so freaky. I love it. It's like the... Um, 
the perspective is uh, strange. I like it. Okay, let's go. Mm. This place has given me the creeps. Uh -huh. Your discomfort is only natural. A fierce battle was waged here. And even after 45 years, the scars remain fresh. Huh. What? You're saying the Gi managed to make it all the way up here? <laughs> okay, somebody fill me in. Who are the Gi? The tribe knows a very few people outside of the Vey. The rest you will learn in due time. Of that you can be certain. For now, let us proceed. The Gi. What are those? I got this. I don't think I've seen you guys. That all right, fire and lightning. There. You ready for some fun? It's over. All right. Now, coming at you. No mercy. All right. Gotcha. I'm trying to. Uh... No going easy. I was trying to uh, to block. Only the watcher's work is never done. Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> I wonder if Bugen uh, again is that his name? Is uh, going to fight or not? I think it would be cool. Look at that perspective! Damn, that look convenient. I. <laughs> it's so strange, but I like it. Only got two legs here, you know. It re looks really cool. The wall is like that. Oh, are they already? Okay. If I just go. Goodbye. <laughs> Missed. I never use that and I should. I really should. Okay, and then there's up here. I mean, we don't need to kill them, right? Like, a watcher should be able to hey, choose his battles. Where'd you run off to? <laughs> Carefully, you know? Oh, Lord. Alright, okay. Oh. Alright, this one I think we have to. Oh! <laughs> Enough. 
from here, right? Oh, hold. Sorry. Did I just, like, eat it? Cut it with my teeth? <laughs> I think that's what I just had. <laughs> it's going, Anaki! I only got two legs here, you know. I don't know. Woo! I don't really need this stuff, but it's fine. Oh, I think I was able to transmute earlier. Yay! Commander. Enhanced Commander. <laughs> and... Uh, we're almost... Um, I feel like we're almost done like transmuting stuff, but I might be wrong. Oh, I can do this one. Malboro Orb. Shimmering sphere that contains the potent pungence of the infamous Malboro. Extend duration of detrimental status effect applies to foes. Reduration reduces duration of detrimental. Ah. Huh. Okay. Why not? Huh. Huh. Immunity to petrifying stone. Oh, that's interesting. Jeweled ring. Here we're good. Okay, a couple of new uh, new things. I wonder if it's like super good. Oh, we can put another skill. I have not seen that. Enhance elements. No. Magic guard. Attack power. Attack power, I think. Maybe staggering charge. Eh. Yeah, I wanted to see the commander. Wait, is it? It's here. Sorry. Like enhance, enhanced commander, wasn't it? Here. Okay. Oh, actually, that's really good. Damn. <laughs> okay. And for you, is there anything better we could put for you? Oh. Rolled Warrior is better. I can never find a moment to gain the proficiency or even to use the the ability that I'm supposed to get with this weapon. With this color, I mean. I just I don't I don't know. God damn, okay. Let's see, I see how it is. Ooh, ooh, okay. <laughs> This goes up. We don't have to kill those. I don't think so. Oh, okay, I see. The music is very ominous. Damn if that doesn't look convenient. <laughs> I think I think the dude <laughs> Bugen again. I think he chose Barret because he knew that if Cloud went, hey, where'd you run off to? he wouldn't be really neutral. Like, because he clearly has to do something specific, and I think it's, I think their trials for like more like a mental state there anything than anything else. I can speak today. So I'm thinking that he has to forgive his father or something like that and only, you know, someone who doesn't already really love Nanaki, like doesn't, not that Barrett hates him or anything, but, you know, someone that doesn't have a, a bias, you know, a bias to him, then 
will recognize that. I, I don't know, I'm, it's just what I think, but I'm like, maybe that's not the case at all. I don't know. But I think there's a reason why, because he said, oh, then the trial will be meaningless if it's cloud going. Like, what did he mean by that other than, you know, what I'm saying, basically? Watcher's Respite. I can use it now. Just getting started. Okay. Get your paws off of me. This is my turn. <laughs> Sup now? Mm -hmm. Give them hell. It's over. Uh. <laughs> Look out. The... Okay. Can't get me down. Uh. So it's if over. your vengeance you mode on. is vengeance uh, gauge. Is um... Oh, I'm gonna make you howl. Oh, I have my limit. If it's high, then you're gonna heal more. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. I thought it was an astronaut at first. <laughs> Like what this? What the hell is that? That is a key. Oh, okay. It's huge. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would stress that you mustn't judge a book by its cover. But in this... For the key, however, <laughs> they are as fearsome <laughs> as their appearance implies. These are the things that killed my mom? Nanaki, this shall be your first trial. You are to explore this place. Understand the nature of its history. Okay, we'll do. Seek the relic of our past. Carry it forth and bring the truth to light. Mm -hmm. Only then shall the path reveal itself unto you. Press and hold L2 near an object to grab it with your mouth and release the button to drop it. Initial combat will also cause you to automatically drop an, a held item. Scatter around the cavern and ask Jürgen Hagen to inspect them. Alright. Uh, I was about to say this... Um, this looks straight out of a... Uh, it looks like materia. Oh, memories of war. The hour of our awakening draws nigh. Most would call that materia. Yeah. But it is far more than a magic stone. It is a crystallized collection of the planet's memories and knowledge. Okay. Um, it reminds me of Returnal. When I entered this this place, I was like, "This is very Returnal vibe." Now I want to play it. <laughs> well, if it isn't a key arrow, its point is coated with a poison that rapidly circulates through the body, slowing the wounded until they are completely turned to stone. Petrify. A charm. Let's see it. Oh! Increases the limit gauge fill rate by 10%. That's crazy. Is that a club? I'm not sure, uh, but I'm pleased to see that you're enjoying yourself. Okay. Wait. Okay. It's just a... Okay. That's a bone. Uh. Nay. 
<laughs> that is but a mere bone. I mean, we never know. I don't know what I took. Nay. A pebble. Oh, 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 sorry. I haven't slept well of late. A crystal. Okay, it's better than a pebble. <laughs> yeah, how can he sleep well if he hears the planet crying all the time, you know? In the suffering. Ah, a remnant of our struggles, of our desires. What about this? This one is useless. Ah, cool. That's what I wanted to do, but I wasn't sure if it would work. Wait, did it go back up? I think it did. Oh, shit. Okay, but I want to try. <laughs> I want to try it. I'm sure it's nothing, but... Oh, okay, can just jump down. Nice. Ah, yes. An armament of the Fey. The carvings on its hilt should look familiar. Indeed, you'll find the very same markings on your own body. But I was not ready. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Okay. Watcher's spirit. Deplete event escape to increase allies ATB. Oh, that's cool. We lose uh, a link. But it's not the end of the world. Let's see what we have here. Mm -hmm. That's very nice. Let's put this. And this, I think. Ah, uh, this. Yeah. And... I'm gonna get rid of that. Unless I put it down here. Oh, I could have done that, yeah. I could have done that. Let me just switch. <laughs> um, where is it? Elemental. So now I'm protected against fire and ice, basically. Uh, yeah, I could add... Um, another HP up, maybe? What do I have right now? I have a 20%. It's not really worth... Uh, maybe cleansing, why not? That's fine. We'll get back to the other when we get the chance. The other color, I mean. Get rid of that thing! Eh. We're gonna fight. In suffering we stir. Who wakes us from our slumber? Alright. Oh my health. Opalai, Opalai. Um. Yeah! Well, shit. Kiss my Now! Okay, let me. Kiora. Bring it home! Alright. And now let me see. Okay. Fire. Hitting them with healing spells will pressure them. Spin the spears to deflect all range physical attacks, hitting them with clo strong close range physical attacks while they are doing this will pressure them. They will not remain dead so long as a Gi sorcerer is present. Time to shine. Open the house. How's this? Fear me! Uh, 
Jesus, what the fuck is this? Oh, yes, yes, yes. You thought was a fallen key. Ooh, he Even went out death, air, babe. Their lingering enmity manifests as such. They who wander in search of retribution. That's kind of pathetic. Do not be so quick to denigrate your enemies, nor make light of their plight. Consider this statue. It has been placed in this chamber for a reason. Handle it with the utmost care. I will. Deliver unto us. I feel like he's too young to do any of this. But maybe I'm misjudging. Okay, I just, I just understood what it reminded me. Like, why have I heard of that before? I don't, was, did I hear that in Final Fantasy before? I'm not sure. But, God of War Rangarok. <laughs> now that's where <laughs> the, the, the boss, the fucking Are boss in Vanaheim. Altars? I think it's Nidhogg, right? Interesting, because my first thought was, are we going to make it out of this place alive? <laughs> its decor is indeed the opposite of inviting. These look like the statue I picked up. If there is a reason for everything, then one could argue that everything has no reason. Regardless, you know what you must do, don't you? Deliver unto us the remnants. Find all of them, bring past. them back here. Restore them to their rightful place. Um here. Right here? No? Isn't it? Here? have two more to go this one is gonna be the yellow one this path am I mistaken no I'm mistaken <laughs> hey, we can transmute a lot of stuff suddenly to say something and I've forgotten. Well, that one was easy. I don't know why we're doing this in the grand scheme of things, though. Our anger gives way to calm. Okay, that's nice. <laughs> 
like in the grand scheme of whatever's going on in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Do you know what I mean? Like, I, I don't really know how this is going to tie with the main story. I know I'm, I'm like, asking this question super early, obviously. We'll see, but... I don't... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> hey! Where'd you run off to? Oh yeah, I'm alone now. True. Okay, we can go there, but we can also go here. Uh huh. A fortification, okay. Wait. Okay, nothing to do here. The way he swims. So cute. Just a big softy. He's such a softy or something. I don't remember how Eric said it, but it was so funny. I liked it. <laughs> okay. Hello? Godama. <laughs> and I have to fight on my own. Okay. Oh, I've seen those statues. I've seen them in, um, in like a circle in Cosmo Canyon. Like before reaching the village, obviously. Stay there. I feel of course. the presence. The villain. Ooh. Yes. Come close. That we may have our vengeance. It's over! Ah. Like, all right! Try and stop me! Come on! Pile it on! How's this? Coming at ya! And then... Just gotta stay the course! Okay. It's all good. I'm back! So agile. Well, that was easy. I thought it would take longer than that. I want a big boss, a difficult boss. These are easy. Ah, our sadness sinks beneath stone. The history of the Vale is intertwined with the Gee. For they first came to these lands many millennia ago. This sanctuary is proof of their persistence, for it was built to ensure that they never escaped. But if they were sealed away thousands of years ago, how'd they break out and attack the veil? Vale? That I cannot answer. Only the key themselves could. But enough about them. You are here to learn about yourself, Nanaki. That's what I was saying! <laughs> this the cave serves as a boundary true. between our world and that of the Gi. It was vital to them and their plans. Were the Gi to seize control of it, the canyon would be doomed. And the people. When the Gi moved against us yet again, a certain watcher recalled this vulnerability. Huh? Since time was of the essence, he entered the cave without reinforcements. Mm. As he had feared, it was teeming with Gi, ready to descend upon the village. His Determined father. to protect the veil, he pounced from one foe to the next, 
felling all who dared oppose him. Hold on. If there was a Watcher who single-handedly saved the canyon, how come I've never heard of them? It's your father! <laughs> For now, you should focus on your own struggles with the Gi. He didn't Their just run away. Lots of the uh, Mako. It's a Mako cave. Kind of. Whoa. It's definitely good. <laughs> Ambiance. <laughs> the music is so good. Do not allow fear to take hold of your heart. You are your own master, Nanaki. You and no one else. Never forget that. Look to the crevasse and the gates beyond. Pass through all to complete your trial. But okay. that's easier said than done. That's what I wanted to say earlier. There's a lot of words and inspiration deriving from um, Norse mythology in uh, Final Fantasy VII. I've never talked about this before, I think. But, you know, even Midgar is, you know, now Nidhogg, we, we've had, um, uh, I, I, I am blank right now, but I know there's been other names, like many other names that are derived i feel like they're derived from norse mythology which is interesting you know because why like why norse mythology in in such a in such a game you know i don't know but it fits only the watchers it does work never done watchers work is never done oh it was just for are you kidding? No, I think I can go. Yeah. Okay. Just a second. Uh. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are those? Fate. Okay. Ice. Take a gamble. Feel the heat. Don't let him now. What is he? Hope you don't mind if I leave for the hole. You ready for some fun? Uh. Now, you're mine. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna burn. It's over. Fear me. Now. Uh. Going in. Wait, I can't hurt it for some reason. That was weird. Ah, oh, they have like a, a one last... Uh... Hooray! <laughs> Before dying. <laughs> that, that was strange. Okay. I think we can actually go. Wow, the music. <gasps> New weapon, obviously we will so go. How are we supposed to open this thing? How oh, indeed. Ideas, Nanaki. Mm -hmm. I love the song. It's so good. You asked for it. Yeah. Alright, gotcha. Try and stop me. No mercy, alright? You're mine! Let me see again. Ah, that's cool. I like that. I had it. Oh, this is gonna burn. The roulette. Now, coming at ya. Tear into him. Pile it on. Last chance. It's over. Try pulling the chains as far as... Well, uh, why do you tell me what to do now? Like, 
I haven't even seen yet what I can do in game. I hate when games do that, when they, uh, when they handhold puzzles too much. I find it annoying. I think we did all right back there. Like, let me look around first, you know. Uh Oh, smack down. Strike two or more enemies. Sure. No, oh, I think I'll <laughs> I use overcharge all the time. Oh, I haven't done the, the new ability with the with Nanaki. But we don't have a sorcerer. So it's all good. Watch it learn. Don't worry about it. Ryan. Gotcha. Cool. for uh, wires that's why I love um I could just go wait that's why I love one wing angel Sephiroth's theme uh, because of the choir of like is it's just I love it I can't get enough of it it's so good It's over! Oh, you got Get mine! Yeah! Fight Let's up. end this! Fuck on me! Good to go? Need so my help, on. do you? Need my help, Don't do ya? Leave it to you. me! Go it in! It's over! Here goes! Yeah. Nah. Did I do good or okay. did I do good? So yeah, the choir here reminds uh, me a little bit of uh, of uh, not not only the second you know, in uh, in One Wing Angel, like just just the the slow down. Okay. Oh Jesus. The slow down version 
of um, of One Wing Angel is incredible because you hear this type of uh, of choir, you know. Okay, so what? Oh, that's that's why I was like, okay, this looks like something I could break, or I didn't think I could uh, put it there. Hello, is there a sorcerer? Yes, there is. Let's kill this one first. Ooh, he dodges a. Eh? He dodges a. Eh? Come on, dude. Please, Zaga, uh, dude. Oh boy. Okay, we're fine. How is this? Gotcha. You ready for some? Come on. Damn it. Haha. Look out. Oh lord. Oh lord. Oh lord. Okay. Okay. It's over. There. Try and stop me. Got him now. Only one winner. Now, finish. You ready for some fun? You're mine. Look out now. We beat them. Have you now? In what sense? They have yet to truly pass on, and their rage remains unquenched. Come, let us keep pressing forward. We're very near. Them. Whoa, 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 let me go. <laughs> We're following. Damn, if that doesn't look convenient. <laughs> oh. Okay. you at all they're just annoying <laughs> but they don't hurt they just defate and shit like if they are paired with other enemies then they can be a pain in the ass but all on their own they're really not Only 
got two legs here, you know. I knew. This reminds me of those altars. I don't see. Okay. Oh, how did he? He only has two legs. How did he come there up? There is a similarity, yes. But this sanctum is much more ancient and serves a rather different purpose. The altars we came upon before were built to imprison the key. This, however, was built to provide the Cetra with a means to commune with them. Commune with them? Why would the Cetra do that? The Gi were the enemy. Or not? <laughs> okay, I see where it ties with the main story now. Dichotomy is not set in stone, as mutable as the winds. But for now, Anarchy, let us concentrate on the matter at hand. Clearing Maybe the they tried to, to help against. Genova when she arrived or something? I don't know. There's multiple ways to go at the same place. It's strange. Uh, Alright. Enemies are so different here, like we've never seen them before in the rest of Cosmo Canyon. Jesus. I see here and then I'm gonna pull that here because it's broken probably Friendship increased! Let's go! Can make these things now. Let's see. Uh, Dragonic earring. Increases the gauge charge rate upon successfully blocking. That's cool. Like perfect precision blocking or... Or just blocking. <laughs> it looks crazy, the... The weapon. Um, can we please... Oh my god. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> We're about to go crazy out here. It's fine. It's all good. <laughs> I have no patience <laughs> today, especially for some reason. Okay, let's go. Big boss arena. A big gi or multiple gis. <laughs> the image. Oh, what is it? 
their ire manifests once more. Yeah. Do not underestimate this foe. Okay, he's huge. Oh shit! Mm. Talk about an act. Thanks to groin. Leader of Gi, a people who were driven to extinction and cursed to roam as spirits. Rejected by the live stream. He and his clan have been sealed in an underground cave, left to fan the flames and their hatred in the red miasma that loves them. Huh. If anything enough damage will pressure him. A curse will activate when the soul flame possess a statue. Have HP, have MP, deplete ATV, shrink battlefield. Staggering Gein attack will undo the curse. Doom will inflict instant death after a certain amount of time. I see. No weaknesses. To grind. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, Jesus. Why do you not have time to do anything? It's all good. Bring it home. Guess it's my turn. Um, bonus round. Okay. Bring in the heat. Oh. Okay. Uh, let me do. I think he's disappearing. Yeah. Maximum fury. Aha! Here we go. Uh. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Okay. How, how long are you pressured for? You're already done. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Let me just do a cure on myself. I'm fired up, ready to go. I was blacking! Maybe chilling more. No, Lord. <laughs> Just watch. Is he gaining back health? I think he might be. Good to go. Okay, 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 okay. You're gonna do focus shot. Here we go. We have a synergy ability together. Let's do it. Come on. Okay. It's over. Special delivery. Keep it up. I need to uh, heal. Like Kuraga heal. Okay. That's the curse thing, or...? <laughs> All right, then. So many. Where's a big uh, bucket of water when you need it? The music! <laughs> what the...? Okay, let me just... Once a certain amount of time has passed after their summoning, they will possess a statue. Ah! Okay. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You don't. Can we please? Thank you. Sorry, you're mine. Go for it. Yeah, I'll do it. Suck it. End of the line. Let's do maximum fury. Here we go. Another. No. Execration of the key. Um. You cheating son of a bitch. Leave it to me. 
Okay. Summon Titan, or I don't know who we have with, uh, with you. So I'll check. You ready for some fun? I'm not sure. Gee, that's a cool attack. Leviathan, but we need to. I'm not sure if it's gonna work because of the arena, but we can try. We can try for sure. Okay, whatever, whatever, it's fine. It's all good. Uh, please heal yourself a little bit. Come on. Okay, he has um, he has his limit. Catastrophe. Martial law your strain and channel it into a concentrated beam of energy to the stagger. All right then. That's good with me. I. Woo! Oh, we can. Okay. All right then. Get out there and give him hell. Let me just do a uh, focus shot on him. You ready for going in? No, 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 no. Right. Here we go. I need more. It's Here goes. Okay, 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 okay. Harness to resume massive position of water damage or beam of water. Uh, this one. Okay, um. Let's do. Oh, you hit for it. And I will do. Uh, chilling roar again, and we will. Oh lord! Pure red. Oh doom! Isn't doom the the one the doom countdown has begun? Did you see that? Did you see that? You are. Kidding me right, right now. Okay, we'll use a mist mega potion because I am tired of having no health. Didn't that work at all? Didn't that work like at all? You know what? Fuck off. Come on. Don't give up yet. Okay, it's fine. I almost have my my own <laughs> limits howling moon Where you go need my help do you dare we my dude we are stopping this fucking countdown <laughs> here we go <laughs> at the end Leviathan doing its thing <laughs> when there's one HP left on the boss let's go bye <laughs> Party level 8! Let's go! We'll get new limits! I'm so excited! I've seen! I've seen the new limits we can get! That was a fun fight! Evanescent, rancor, everlasting. A bit messy, but uh, we did it! Well done! You've become quite the formidable fighter! <laughs> sure have! <laughs> So, does this mean I passed the test? Oh, oh. I'm afraid that decision is not mine alone to make. <sighs> Let us consult with one more qualified. All right. The Watcher's Verdict. I think it's gonna be Barrett, no? Isn't it how this works? I'm guessing we don't have to... I'll give an eater. Just in case. Just in case. But we should be okay.
Wall of Honor. <gasps> the Watcher of the Father. Vale fought valiantly and offered up his life in defense of our home. As you see, he still watches over us to this very day. Wow. Wait. With the moon. Is that... Seto? My father? No, there's no way. The poisoned arrows of the key transformed mm. his body into stone. And there he has stood ever since, his watch eternal. Our savior. Wow. What about my mom? Did she know what had happened to him? Oh. oh, oh. Why, of course she did. It was, after all, she and Seto who asked me to see her off the cave. But why? Why did she never tell me the truth? Because she knew that if she did, you would attempt to seek your father out all by yourself. Your parents strove to keep our veil safe. But there is one thing they fought even harder to protect. You, Nanaki, their son. She was afraid because I was too small and weak. <laughs> you were a child. Back then, perhaps, but not anymore, heavens no. You've become a fine warrior in your own right. And that is precisely why I brought you here. <laughs> but this is not where your journey is meant to end, my dear boy. You must leave the Vale once more. Oh. He said he I'm wanted to stay now. here. Yeah. I gotta protect our home like he did. Listen to me, Mamaki. When I first heard your friend's emphatic warnings, I dismissed them outright. No more than the ravings of misguided you. Cloud is there. When you've lived as oh. long as I have, Everyone. you start to believe you've seen it all. But no surprises remain. It's sudden. But I they were realize fallen. now how very foolish I have been. The eyes that I thought saw the world clearly have grown blind to new possibilities. But what made him realize that in the spawn of hate to impede your 30 progress minutes any further? You know what I mean? I bid you leave, Nanaki. Before, like me, you become inured to your own ignorance. With sharper eyes and keener ears, go forth and in my stead seek the great truths of our world. Okay, maybe a couple of but hours, but still. Me. Don't worry. We will. You failed this trial, my boy. Continue your training and try again. Are you up to the task, Nanaki? You bet I am. After all... I am Nanaki, Watcher of Cosmo Canyon, and son of Seto, protector of our Vale. Aww. He's still alive under that. I'm kind of horrified a little. It's cute, but like, it's kind of horrifying at the same time to think of. Can't we get the arrow out or something? <gasps> Mary is crying! Okay, that's gonna make me tear up. <laughs> if anything does. Oh, yeah, the glasses, of course. Of course, you put back the glasses. Hearken <laughs> unto me. Uh. My name is Guy Natak. 
Give us some lore, please. Oh, brave and noble Seto. I beseech you once more. Hear the urgent pleas of my people. My thanks, Seto. You are as magnanimous as ever. <sighs> the warrior Nanaki. And you, the Setra. Come with me. Do we have a choice in the matter? <laughs> Was... Oh, an exciting turn of events indeed. We'll back you up for two thousand. But... <laughs> what? I no, this one's free. <laughs> Arid Red. Please look after Nanaki for us. Blessings of the planet be upon you all. We will escort fellow Bugenhagen back home. Take care, friends. Within that bee's flesh is a tumult of emotion. See to it that Nanaki remains safe. Oh, 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 oh. Our world is filled with wonders. I bid you seek them out. Within that piece, oh, 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 really, oh. this image though is Our incredible is with, with the moon. I bid you seek them out. Beautiful. Ugh. Can anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? Because some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared of my wits here. I don't know. This gee dude's too nice to freak me out. He may act nice, but who knows what he's planning. Stay yeah, away. you haven't fought like they just have, you know. I should look into my materia, yeah, before we continue. All right. I think I'm good now. <laughs> that took a while. <laughs> it's fine. Okay. Sorry. Inlet of the Lost. The music, dude. The home of the Gi lies beyond. <laughs> now let us begin our journey. Okay. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's Materia, you can count me out. How strange you should mention Materia. My people are also in search of it. <laughs> She's on. Okay, all aboard. All aboard, toxic gas. <laughs> of course. <sighs> Would have stayed longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. I really wonder where we're going. Like, I have no idea right now. It's literally like floating on Mako. <laughs> Maybe try swaying with the rocking of the boat? I wanna move less, not more. <laughs> Didn't seem to mind when you jumped aboard. Well, only because he mentioned materia. I am Be bored. quiet. So the bored. planet is Pouring listening. Right out of my brain. And what's wrong with that? Anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the Cetra. Unfortunately, 
The Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse well. me, am I intolerant too? I'm Cetra. <laughs> you are indeed one of them, by lineage alone. You know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Please tell me I am hoping. Their history? Consider your ignorance a blessing. You're kidding. The Cetra's past is fraught with horror and sorrow. Oh, the colors. I mean, we know a little bit, but we'd love to know more. Sector 5 under city. Are we back with Zach? So there I yes! am on the ground, bleeding out, <laughs> watching Ugh. everything go dark. And thanks. Thinking, this is it. This is how it ends. Only, it isn't. Suddenly, the wind picks up out of nowhere. It tugs at me so hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. Okay. That was not broken at all. Hmm. Next thing I know, I'm back in the orphanage. But nobody can tell me. <laughs> uh, I just had a thought and I can't go further without uh, voicing it, but you know at the end after we was it after we broke fate? It was before it was before there was a lot of whispers around the Shinra building. So I think that's what was going on, kind of. Like, uh, there were a lot of them, right? And um, now I'm thinking it's like they put Biggs in a new timeline. Because the Shinra building was not even destroyed in the slightest. And it was before. And then, and then no fire, nothing. So was it like a conduit? Like a... Uh, I don't know, like a, a path? And then he took it with the whispers and then now he's in a new timeline, but he doesn't know that? Like, does he realize? Maybe that's not it at all, but... Who found me or how I got there? It's a miracle. Sounds like what happened to me. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. Yep. And then with first. I'm feeling every single bullet. Wow. But he then was supposed to die. The wind starts blowing. One minute, I'm outnumbered, and the next, I'm alone. None of it makes any sense. I somehow managed to beat the odds and wake up here, alone. I have goosebumps. Why in the hell did fate pick me? Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> and now that it's just me, what am I supposed to do? You know? Yeah, I get it. Hey, come with me. Sure, but why? I'll explain on the way. We have materia. I can change. His hair is really long. I had not realized. Of course. 
So, how's Cloud holding up? Mako Poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. But hey, hope springs eternal. Right. <laughs> if he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and say he's been through no ten times that shit. Are we talking out, about the same cloud? Work. Did he just do a squat when I was not looking? He did, didn't he? Come on. Guys desperate to prove himself. Maybe not like he needs to. Everyone knows he's a bona fide badass. Huh. Hey, why don't you try picking up some work as a merc? A Zack of all trades. Why? Cause one's not enough. I'll think about it. The top of the Shinra building was I think I'm off. right, guys. I think this Biggs is our Biggs. And he doesn't understand what happened, you know, but he thinks every everyone died and but he knows our cloud. And now he was transported into Zack's timeline. So when they talk, it's not the same cloud, you know? Because the other cloud has a fucking mind, like, weird after Mako poisoning, probably. It's like they have a little bit of um, a couple of weeks, maybe, of difference or something, maybe months. Apparently, how am I supposed to take my But the, it's the same events. A lot of good dates started, right? Did you hear? Is this a Is it true? Is he gonna do the squat? He did earlier, didn't he? I just saw him going back up, and I was like... I want to see all the animations. Is that it? There's despair. Uh, just one, okay. Goddamn. I missed it. Get a load of this. <laughs> okay, let's see. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. We can't let those murderers get away with it. People of Midgar fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then anyone who goes is... An idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks who'll risk it all. We'll see the rest of Avalanche, finally. Wait! Don't tell me you're going! The things I do for friends. I don't know why. But I really love Zack. I know we barely know anything of him. But there's just something about him that is so friendly and nice. I don't know. He is awesome. I wanted to say that actually before the little talk they just had. Hey, you ever yeah. wondered about your purpose in life? What you're doing here? Sure, from time to time. Or all the time. Would never have guessed. Didn't used to, but it's things changed. Went through a lot after I joined Shinra, like we only have a lot. To blame. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to do with all this Shinra time I've been getting. something out, right? I mean, they got it. Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah? Cause one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. He didn't tell you? It's gonna be that it's impossible he's with the competition. me. You know? When exactly did you meet Cloud? 
the day before we hit reactor one. So that's uh, that's how our long big. Ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. My internal clock's busted. Yeah, mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> Good question. Ha! Huh, interesting. Do you have trouble knowing when what happened when right now because they were transported? You know or kind of, you know what I mean like they were uh, saved and that fucked with their inner clock days, like interesting I dream about all the things I wish I'd done We still have love less by the way huh? So what do you think's going to happen to our baby Don't know okay. I just wish Now I wish those were my own worries Let's give them a name We may not know what's going to happen but I want I have so much to be grateful for Hey, We've got freebies galore, folks. Come you know, on, I just hope I can treat you and yours to something special. I think I prefer being number two or three in the sky. Suits me much better. Yeah. Why don't we all go camping? Like the guy who only has to worry about the how, and doesn't have to decide on the what. A minor role? Exactly. I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. And who might that be? You were the guy uh, with Aerith, right? Whoever brought you back, I guess? And assuming I mean, there was someone, who could it have been? <laughs> That's a good question. Hell with it! Let's just do what we All want! All on purpose. Robin folks and stop it's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. Nobody, huh? Not a soul. Well, at least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> oh, Lord. Hmm? Huh. New recruit? Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche. I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda, that's all. But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> anyway, I'm out, losers. <laughs> I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. What was the backpack uh, about? Sorry for wasting your time. And why doesn't he have a wound? It's been a while already? Like, how long? Biggs! It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's gotta be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. We're not powerless. So long as we don't lose sight of what's important. <sighs> you know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, like your life depends on it. Isn't that what the Buster Sword the says? The world's lucky to have you. The description. It's a start. Hmm. Anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get the chance. See ya. Think about what I said. It's something like hopes and dreams of the Guess ones I before. Guess I should probably head home too. I might be mistaken. Hmm. Oh, huh. And he doesn't have a scar, so it's been it's been already a couple of weeks, months, or what's up with the bag? Okay, I got a backpack. We just feel trying supplies. Perhaps uh, she hoped to join Avalanche after all. That's not our backpack. Am I tripping? 
Doesn't she have everything blue? Maybe not. Maybe I'm... Maybe I'm mistaken. But she's probably going... Like in the other timeline, you know, she's probably going for... Um... Mm, nice. Um... She wanted to go to Costa del Sol and everything. But she's in Junon. In our timeline, at least. This is the saddest shit I've ever seen, by the way. Like, no. I don't. I do not accept this. <laughs> it's because Aerith is not doing well. She's like. unconscious, kind of. In a coma. I'm back. Welcome home. Welcome home. Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? Uh. Said he'd visit too. Oh yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? No, oh, uh, sorry. Forgot to ask. Here, go. Aww. Zach, mm. would you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. We're all headed for the same place. You'll see your Daddy and Tifa again. Soon? If we converge. Soon enough, Marlene. Soon enough. Imagine two more leads. <laughs> it's me. The wind, that was you, wasn't it? For the bullets? Hello in there. How does he know something like that? could connect to her other We've body arrived. for a second there through the live stream I guess it's Mako I'm going crazy yo the drama no way no way this is crazy still standing I'm still standing Hmm? Oh. Okay, bye. Welcome to the village of the Gi. Yeah, thanks. Okay, uh, that was very eye-opening. Oh, new weapon, good lord. What is it? Oh, nice for Aerith. <laughs> ATB Ward! Let's go! Oof, we lose a lot of uh goddamn of materia. Um, um uh, wow, that's a very makeshift uh, store. I like it. I don't know why I slept. I don't think I needed that. It was very eye-opening, guys. No, well, it 
confirmed some things. I had not realized that it was our bigs. I had not realized that until now. I did not think. Yes. Fuck yes. Finishing touch, my dude. I absolutely need that. I don't care. I'm gonna take off a lot of shit just to get that. You know what? I'm gonna reset all. Because I just really wanna... Wanna have that. We'll take this. And then this. And then... This. I have 60 points still, so I could... Yes, very important. Also very important. What about this one? ATB charge. Uh, I like this one. Oh, it's with, it's with Kate, I don't care. Melee blade I do love. Relentless Rush is pretty good, too. Here we go. So, of course, I'm not gonna do as much damage. I had a lot of, uh, of little things, you know? You know what? I feel like I actually would prefer... Oh, shit. Sorry about that. I just I think I would prefer having max HP instead of this one. I'm gonna put it back. Finishing touch. And we also have aerial onslaught. That's new. Launch a deadly assault from above. Can only be performed in midair. Class is a weapon ability. That's that's new. That is new. So that's pretty cool. Now here we also have fills the other party members limit break. Really? Transcendence. Focus your magical energy to unleash non elemental magical magic attacks. Has various effects while charging, such as increasing magic attack. Okay. I'm not sure. Um, I think for the others, I will wait. I just did it for Cloud because I'm like, like, come on, we need to limit level increase. <sighs> yeah, okay. <laughs> no, I'll wait. I'll wait. For red, what do we have? Wrath of the land. Call upon the might of the planet and rend the enemy with deadly fangs. And that's retaliation. If attacked during vengeance mode, perform a ferocious counterattack. Cost 2 ATB ends vengeance mode. Okay. It's not as interesting, I will say. Sure, let's just take something. What about berry? Decimate the enemy with beams of light from beyond the stratosphere. <laughs> Lifeblood cannon. Consume all ATB charges and half your HP to fire a high powered shot. Okay. Tifa. Now that interests me. Oh. Meteor strikes. Jesus. As she literally becomes a meteor. That's crazy. Rain down a series of devastating blows each way to the force of falling meteor. Trinity strike. After activation, press square with the correct timing to unleash three guns. Ooh, I like this. I like this. Okay, we will do the same with her. Let's 
this one. Critical hit rate. What is this? Limit level increase. Here we go. She has it now. Critical hit rate is good. We'll do it like that. It's it's a bit weird, but uh I don't I don't play with Kate, so I don't really care. Yuffie. Devastation. Overwhelm the enemy with powerful ninjutsu. Now, Yuffie, yes. I do want to get that. Alright. Cost 3 ATB. Only available during United Refocus. Storm's Fury. Yeah, I bet. I don't think I have United Refocus with her anymore, though. Do I? Oh, maybe I do down here. Yeah, I do with Barrett. Okay, that's perfect, actually. I could take off... This one I really love. So I'm gonna take off this. And grab that instead. Like, this one is really good. I always have it. Um, yeah, it's gonna be like that. It's a little bit sad, you know, but... I really want to try these uh, limits, but I need synergy. I need to do synergy with with them to be able to increase the limit. You know what I mean? Unless you can put it as like a skill. Yeah, no, you need you need to do it twice. You need to do limit twice to augment to three. So that's gonna be a bit hard, but whatever. It's gonna be useful for really hard bosses that you spend a lot of time fighting. We're gonna end it here, actually. Um, that was amazing, honestly. I'm so happy with those flashbacks from uh, Zack's timeline where it's actually our beings. And it's really, it confirmed what I was thinking because it's really um, what we saw at the end of Remake was Zack's timeline, like the other stem timeline. Uh, it, it was that because we saw Biggs in the orphanage alive. It's our Biggs still, but we saw him at the orphanage and then we see Marlene being like that, but it's not. It's probably Zack or not Zack, I guess Elmira or I don't know, but it's definitely not Barrett. Um, but yeah, it's definitely the other timeline and because today he said I woke up at the orphanage I don't know who got me out and then Zach says The win was you wasn't it speaking of talking to Aerith And I find that very interesting <laughs> because one of my thoughts when Tifa went into the live stream was that the um, whispers, the white whispers, they look like they have Aerith's orb, Materia orb in them. And I was like, are they Aerith's? Just like Sephiroth or Genova's are purple? And that kind of confirms it, if I'm not crazy. Like, it kind of does, because he said the win was you, wasn't it? It was the whispers. I mean, maybe he just doesn't know. He knows she's a Cetra and she's powerful, so maybe he just says that, like... Because he couldn't see the whispers, obviously. 
he couldn't see them. So maybe he thinks it was just Aerith in a way because she's Cetra. But maybe she is controlling the whispers somehow. I don't know though if it's this Aerith or the Aerith that is in currently in a coma. Maybe she's in a coma because her soul, her essence <clears throat> is currently in the live stream. And that's how she was able to connect with Zack with her hand. Am I am I making any sense? Because she base either she took the place of the other Aerith for a second there to the live stream, but how does that make sense? I mean, I guess it makes sense with the timelines and convergence possible. Like the the skyline being all jagged and shit. <laughs> you know, and then fate is part of the planet and everything. So maybe through the live stream, you just see... You can go in all those timelines, you know? Maybe there's more than two. Like... I don't know, but maybe it's because her other her counterpart in Zack's timeline is in the live stream that's why she is unconscious kind of like cloud maybe he's in the live stream as well i am my brain is firing up right now <laughs> ah! Yeah, I cannot. I fucking love how Biggs was like describing a cloud that Zack doesn't know. And he's like, are we talking about the same cloud? So I'm so curious to meet the other cloud because I have a feeling and that's where my fucking crazy theories come in, right? I have a feeling, right? I've talked about this before last episode was the last episode i'm not even sure i've had that feeling since gongaga i guess but you know that somehow uh cloud has zach's memories in himself you know like zach's essence or something and that might have changed him and he took some of zach's quirks and shit <laughs> and memories and made them his own without knowing right so i i feel like that's why he does the squat thing and that's why he is the main protagonist in the nebelheim memory whereas it was probably zack is what i think and he cloud was just a shinra guard he was not a so he was never a soldier i don't know he does have the soldier get up though um in the uh, the first class soldier in in the other timeline so maybe he became soldier after like i don't i don't know but in the nibelheim he probably wasn't and then we take the place of the shrinigard and then he has like the f his gloves that he has currently it makes no sense his memory is fucking jagged broken and i'm pretty sure interwoven with zack in some ways even though and that's what is crazy and that's that's what i thought that's why i thought it wasn't like this because he has that but he doesn't know he does and so he doesn't know zach and his mind just blocked that out because maybe he, he was traumatized by that or something i don't know but i'm pretty sure he was supposed to die with that bullet zach like in our timeline for our cloud that's how it happened he was like lying on the like comatose uh, and then zach got killed like got headshot and then somehow someone found cloud and helped him overcome the mako poisoning i don't know but that's what happened to our current cloud is what i think where was i going with this <laughs> there's so much to say there's so many details that the game throws at you and then doesn't talk about for like hours on end. Do you know how long we've been playing this game? 84 hours. 
It does not feel like 84 hours, let me tell you. I don't feel like that at all. But yeah, like, we barely have seen Zack in all those 84 hours, and we're supposed to, like... Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Um... Oh, where was I going with it? I, I, should, uh, I should make a list and uh, whatever for the next episode so we can probably talk about that properly talk about that in the beginning of the next episode or something because right now I'm just my thoughts are all over the place you get the gist of it though like you you get what I where I'm at I guess but I'm just not making any sense and then I think of something but I'm already talking about something else and then I forget that I wanted to talk about the other thing and bleh, you know what I mean and I'm tired a little bit so but yeah I uh, I was talking about Zack and I wanted to say something about that, but I, I forgot. But yeah, no, I really like how Biggs... Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. I really like how Biggs was like, Yeah, you know, Cloud, how he is, la la la, and Zack is like... Really? He's not like that? So now I'm so excited because I want to meet Cloud, the actual Cloud. This is this? From what I understand, is not even the real deal. Which actually horrifies me. Because I fucking love this cloud. <laughs> but then, then what? Like, I've been loving and uh, fucking... How can I explain? I've been learning and loving... Learning about and loving a character that doesn't actually exist. Basically, I mean he does, but he's like an, a mashup of whatever is going on, and he is broken. <laughs> like it's not really him. I'm horrified. Like I, I don't want that. You know, I don't want that for him. I don't want that for me. <laughs> I love this cloud. I don't want him to change necessarily. You know, like I think he's. You know, he's a bit cold, but he just he just want he just needs a hug, you know. And I love that about him. But apparently he's not like that at all. Like that's not how he is for Biggs. Uh, for uh, Zach. I mean, that's how he is for Biggs, but not Zach. Zach is like What do you mean? Uh That's not the cloud I know. Like when did you meet him? And then their internal clock is fucked. That's so interesting. It's like time and space was warped for them, especially for Biggs, who completely was taken out of a timeline and put into another one. Like that's, first of all, that's fucking crazy. Okay, it's like, oh lord, I see. Oh, that's exactly what is. Okay, I think I think what happened is. <laughs> Somehow, Biggs died, right? He died in our um, timeline. And then in the other timeline, maybe he was not dead yet. And the whispers, Aerith, question mark, <laughs> grabbed uh, Biggs' soul, put it through the live stream, put it in a new body of Biggs, like other Biggs, or something like that. Maybe I'm crazy, but I think that's what she just did. Like, when she touched Zack's hand. I think that's kind of like what she just did. She went through the live stream, kind of, and then was in the other Aerith's body for a second there. Or maybe it's just always all connected. You're always connected to your your other use <laughs> um, when you're in the live stream, when you're touching the live stream. That that's possible. But your other use must be unconscious or dead for you to be connected with their body or them. I guess I don't know that would also explain oh my god okay last thing I I swear I'm finishing this because now I'm just going crazy that would explain how Sephiroth exists in our timeline 
Because he's supposed to be dead. He's actually supposed to be dead. Now I know he's not really here. Like he's kind of a hallucination Genova thing. Uh, living vicariously through vessels, you know, like he's not really... He's not really there. And that's a different thing from the live stream. Like Genova cells, vessels are different from the live stream, at least in my opinion, I think. But it would still explain how he was actually there in the live stream when he tried to kill Tifa. Like he was physically there and tried to kill the weapon. It would explain. It means he is connected through all his bodies. I don't know how many of them, but he can like switch. He can like go in all timelines basically. But he could even do that before fate broke, so I guess that's not really relevant. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where this is going. I'm just I'm just rambling at this point. But I I just want to reiterate that I really liked that um, interlude with Zach. That was, and I'm pretty sure he squatted when I was not looking. The little shit. I will need to look back as soon as I stop recording. I'll be like, okay, did he? Maybe he didn't, but yeah, no, that's uh, so interesting. I am absolutely gripped by this narrative. I think they are actually doing time space shit well so far from what I can understand. Now, maybe it's going to get a lot more convoluted at the end, because if it's anything like Remake, <laughs> I'm gonna get my mind blown again. <laughs> but I feel like they are doing really, really well, and it's just so interesting how they're gonna... If it can converge, my life is made. Like, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm guessing it's gonna happen in like the third game, though. Probably not this one. But if the timelines could converge and Zack could meet this cloud, which is a mashup of Zack himself and other things, can you imagine? And if he could meet this Aerith, you know? If Biggs could see them again. If we could have two more Aliens with Barret. Because Barret is dead in the other timeline. Oh, gee, maybe it's, it will be the only way for the other Marley, Marlene to have Barrett is if he switches timelines as well. But then our Marlene will be an orphan, so it's not, it's not better. We just need two Marlenes, that's all. Just bring, bring the other. <laughs> Can they? Is that possible? Can you have two in the same place? It has not been the case yet. You know, that's what I thought at the beginning of the game. I thought, okay, fate broke everything. You can have two of the same people at the same place. Because I thought that's what happened in the Nibelheim memory. But but now I understand that it's just... I think it was Zack. But I, back then I thought, okay, there were two clouds. Fine. All right. I was just jumping on the train. Okay, let's go. <laughs> no problem, you know? And then I thought, okay, maybe there's... Um, you know, two, two Barretts and two, two Bigs and, you know, in the same timeline, why not? Like, you, you don't know, right? But I don't think that's the case. I don't think that has ever been the case in this game so far. There hasn't been the same person at the same place. Maybe it would, like, fuck up something in, like, a really grand scale. And the planet is like, no, <laughs> you can't do that. I don't know. On, on, only if you're dead in one of your timelines, then you can, like, travel. You know what I mean? Anyways, I'm done, guys. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm rambling, so uh, I will end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed the, um, the episode. I really did. I didn't understand at first the... Like, the Watcher of the Veil. Okay, it was a super nice story, don't get me wrong, but I didn't get how it tied with the main story but now i think i get it because of like what we're, we're about to do i'm guessing we'll learn more about 
the Guy, but especially their relationship with the Setra is what interests me here. Um, they said that they were conversing together and he knows Setras and stuff like that. So that is going to be, uh, that statue is insane. Holy shit. Um, that is going to be very interesting to learn more about. And even Aerith, our Aerith has lost a lot of her memories. She said so herself, right? So maybe all that we're going to learn, maybe she used to know that and she doesn't anymore. So I'm really excited to see if she's going to learn new things or if she's gonna be like oh oh yeah i know that actually or you know you know what i mean but i guess the erit in the live stream if that's the case has more knowledge and that's why her materia is white and ours is not and i'm trying to tie everything up but i'm sure i'm messing things and messing up things as well um because this game is insane so yeah that's my uh, <laughs> that's my theories thoughts and outro today <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!